What's up ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, and today we're going to be taking a look at some of the awesome Star Wars creations that were on display at Brick Fair, Charlotte, North Carolina. Now I may sound a little sick in this video, but no matter, the show must go on. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get started with this video. Now the first mock shown here is the Battle of Scarif from Rogue One, a Star Wars story. Now this one is created by the one and only Solid Brick Studios. As you can see, there is some beautiful diorama and cool figure placement. The trees are absolutely awesome with its unique design. And of course, we cannot also dismiss the awesome ATACTs that are placed on this mock. Uh, cool little backstory, a kid actually knocked one of these over and uh, the on-site uh, Empire Leg Medics had to repair it. But uh, other than that, uh, you know, this mock is just absolutely amazing and awesome work here by David. Next up, we have Kessel from Solo, A Star Wars Story. Now, this one is built by Matt, or better known as The Brick Wiz. Now, this mock is absolutely amazing with the stunning rock work, the custom Kessel Run UCS Falcon, uh, the figures that are used on this mock, the sleek look. Uh, what I also uh, like about this mock a lot is the fact that uh, there's not really like a border to it. It's somewhat kind of free form, but at the same time, there is a border. Uh, if you notice, he kind of puts slopes on the side, which I think is just a really cool touch. Uh, there's also a really cool entrance there. Uh, next is, you know, you know, he's got some cool details on here, like the tower and stuff like that. And then this is the back side that you can see here. Awesome details inside, even though you can't really see it at conventions. Some nice greebles and unique parts usage here by Matt. Next up, we actually have the mock that I created. I'm not going to talk much about this mock being that I created it and I don't really want to take away from the other builders here, but I will show it for you guys because it is Star Wars. If you guys want to know more about the mock, I'd recommend checking out some of the other videos on my channel. But uh, yeah, this is the Battle of Mimban and I decided to display it. Now this mock actually isn't Star Wars, but I decided to show it because it's Lord of the Rings and you don't really see that many Lord of the Rings mocks anymore at conventions. Now this is the Orc Outpost at the Shire. This is created by Blaine's World. Uh, really, really cool build here. It's kind of a reference to the book. And then next up, we have the uh, Udin Outpost on Mordor. Uh, awesome creation here. Definitely love the uh, wall design and greebles. Uh, really, really cool. Next is another mock of mine. This is the showdown at Savarine, and it's basically depicting the scene from Solo where Infa's nest and her gang kind of meet up with uh, Beckett's crew and have a cool, almost Western uh, Mexican standoff. Next is another mock created by Matt or the Brick Wiz. Now this one is actually a very interesting mock. This was a part of the Secret Missions collab for Empire Leg a couple months ago. And uh, it's basically depicting uh, Scarif before the Empire actually created a facility on it. Uh, so really cool stuff there by Matt. Now this is a small little vignette. I believe Lee or Brick Builder Studios created this one. Uh, but really, really cool. Now next is a Fortnite sign. This one's definitely created by uh, Lee or Brick Builder Studios. The next is another Secret Missions of the Empire mock. Uh, now this one's created by William or Lego Hub Productions. Now this is an indoor mock, really, really cool, kind of depicting of, you know, if the Death Troopers were at the Battle of Endor, some really cool designs and unique details there. Now there is the Indiana Jones mock, which I think is absolutely awesome. I know it's not Star Wars, but I definitely have to give it some recognition here. Next is the Obi-Wan's house. Now, this one's cool because you don't really see mocks of this uh, too often. Uh, I like seeing these kind of unsung, uh, unique scenes from Star Wars being created by LEGO, but definitely unique techniques here and stuff like that. I really, really enjoyed this mock and looking at it and all the cool little details and portrayal of the scene. 
Next is the Battle of Abafar. Now this one's created by Lego Hub Productions. Now this is a really cool mock because you don't really see this built that often. This is a Clone Wars mock and this is pretty much the scene where Gregor is introduced into the show. Next is a really, really cool crate mock created by Beast Mode Bricks. Now crate has been created a lot, but this one's really, really cool actually. There's a lot of cool vehicles on there. Uh, some cool little details. The wall is absolutely amazing. You have the rock work, and then there's also kind of a uh, underground part of the mock. Now this mock was actually at my Star Wars tour from Brick Fair, Alabama, but this is a really cool mock. I always enjoy seeing it because uh, it you don't really see mocks with these buildable figures, and I think it's an interesting take and unique way to portray Star Wars scenes. I uh, also really love it because it's the, you know, the Empire. Now this one is another one that is involving Death Troopers. Uh, now this is interesting because it kind of reminds me of like a Embara mock. Uh, so really, really cool stuff here. I just absolutely love looking at these mocks and these dioramas. They are absolutely amazing. So, uh, now this one is actually the Jabba Cell Barge with the Sarlacc Pit. Uh, really cool stuff there. It's, you know, depicting that iconic scene where unfortunately Boba Fett uh, it kind of died. Now next is a interesting Kashyyyk mock. Uh, there's some cool little figures in there and uh, some cool little parts usage. Definitely a cool portrayal of Kashyyyk. Next is Docking Bay 94 from Lego Clone 123. Now this one let me just say, this is an absolutely amazing mock. This is one of my favorite mocks at Brick Fair. There's so many cool, unique details and greebles in this mock with the Falcon and the cool little curvatured walls, uh, cool figure placement. I mean, I absolutely love this mock. Uh, he did a great job, and I look forward to seeing this at future conventions, really. I mean, this is just amazing work. And so that will conclude the Star Wars tour of Brick Fair, Charlotte, North Carolina. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Be sure to keep watching as I'm going to show some of my favorite moments and highlights that I experienced with some of my friends at Brick Fair. So without further ado, please enjoy the rest of the video. Thanks for watching, guys. Turn around, turn around! Come back!